What would you do? A woman looked through her blinds early this morning to see a man fully nude standing on the other side of the glass door. It's not the first time something like this has happened in Austin's Hyde Park neighborhood. And as KXAN's Chris Davis explains, now one woman is sounding the alarm. So I was hanging out at home last night. It was probably three, two or three in the morning, and I kept hearing sounds outside. She didn't see anything the first couple times she looked out until she opened up the blinds to check again. There was a man standing um, on the other side of my sliding glass door, completely naked with his hands on his hips, like power stance, just standing there very close to the door. This woman called police. I don't know what his intentions are. I don't know if he's trying to break in and get in, if he's going to break the glass. Um, if there's somebody else out there too. She doesn't want us to use her name or show her face, but she does want to warn her neighbors on Speedway near 45th. The woman posted her story on the social site Reddit. Others responded with similar stories in Hyde Park. Several of my friends have had peeping toms. Austin police couldn't find any recent similar reports in the area. But neighbors we talked to off camera said they've heard about a naked man walking the neighborhood in recent months. This woman says it's just a fact of life here. It's sad to say that, but you do get kind of used to just like watching your back all the time. Chris Davis, KXAN News. Well, the woman describes him as a white man, about five foot seven, thin in his mid 20s or 30s. APD says if you see anyone acting suspiciously, call police. We want to know how often something like this has happened in Hyde Park in the last year. Well, last September, a man was arrested after a woman called 911 when she caught him looking through windows. Back then, police had gotten several reports about a man wearing dark clothing and looking into windows. Richard Langer was charged with disorderly conduct. In May, at least six women reported a man had groped them while they were walking or running. Austin police say the suspect was a man in his 20s to 30s with a thin athletic build. We checked today to see if any arrests have been made since then, but have not heard back. Peeping Toms do not usually end up serving jail time. That's because the charge is considered disorderly conduct. That's a Class C misdemeanor. The punishment is up to a $500 fine.